George North has warned wing rival Johnny May his best is yet to come ahead of Saturday's Six Nations showdown. Eddie Jones has the deadliest finisher in the world at his disposal after a prolific run of 12 tries in 12 matches. But North, who has 80 caps to his name at just 26 years old, believes he can kick things up a gear at the Principality Stadium this weekend. Hopefully I haven't peaked, I think there is plenty more left to go, said North. There are bits I can work on in my game to take it to the next level. For me and a lot of the boys it is a big block now with the Six Nations then leading into the World Cup. Certainly there is more to give from now until then. There is more to give. As the game develops I will need to change. Hopefully I can keep up with it and I think there is certainly more to give to get to there. North has racked up 38 tries during his test career and is now only three behind Shane Williams' Welsh Six Nations record tally of 22. He will get a chance to add to that tally in a backline steered by Gareth Anscombe at outside half after he beat Dan Bigger in the race to wear the number 10 shirt. North will be going head-to-head -head with May, who gave the French defence nightmares with a 29-minute hat-trick in England's hammering of Les Bles in round two. A major factor in the Red Rose victory was their ability to kick to space in behind their disorganised opposition for May to use his rapid pace. And North admits Wales will have to shut down the space to slow England's speed demon if they want to put themselves in the Six Nations box seat. He's been playing very well, the way that England play has certainly suited his game, that very front foot, game line dominant, shifting the ball into space and kicking is a huge thing for them. Added North. When you have got gas like that you can exploit it, and it's certainly working at the moment for them. It's something that's a big part of their game at the moment.